I've always been fascinated by fascination itself. The search for knowledge, the discovery of new vistas, being curious about how things work. So it was a very short leap to get involved in research. The most exciting moment in doing research is always when one discovers something that is able to be translated into a direct treatment. This is why I've always been motivated by clinical research and in particularly work uh, aimed at discovering novel therapies for people with mood or psychiatric disorders. Mental health contributes the largest burden of disability in the developed world. These emotions that we deal with are in many ways uh, inimitable to the human condition and the disorders of the emotions that compromise mood disorders I don't believe are ever going to go away. All we can hope for is that we will be able to identify them and treat them effectively when they arise. The field is moving very rapidly and there are many things that are understood now that weren't understood as short as five or ten years ago. We have a much better understanding of what the biomarkers are that seem to be underpinning the processes that drive these disorders. And understanding these biomarkers is opening an entirely new vista for the, the discovery of novel therapies. The BBRF award is a truly humbling thing. It is an incredibly gratifying source of recognition for a lifetime's work. I think that the biggest challenge is how do we take the knowledge that we have and implement it more broadly. We're only just beginning to uncover therapies that are capable of helping people. Much work remains to be done and the field is going to keep many energetic, bright young people busy for many decades.